mpango wa kumpumzisha mwenda zake rais Mwai Kibaki imekamilika. Hao ni kwa mujibu wa waziri wa usalama wa ndani daktari Fred Matiangi ambaye amesema kuwa mazishi hayo yataongozwa na maafisa wa jeshi KDF. Haya yanajiri wakati ambapo Kenya walijitokeza kwa wingi katika majengo ya bunge hii leo kumwaga hayati rais Kibaki. Kwa siku ya tatu na ya mwisho wa Kenya walijitokeza kumwaga hayati Rais Mwai Kibaki kabla ibada ya mazishi siku ya Ijumaa. Muda wa kutazama mwili ulipokuwa karibu kuisha ndivyo wengine walionekana kuharakisha angalau wasikose nafasi hiyo. Waliopata nafasi ya kumwaga Rais wa Mwenzi walielezea furaha ya kufanya hivyo. When Kibaki was in power, he remembered the officers, police officers, prison officers and he increased our salary. Namkumbuka kwa sababu yeye ni image of the power of democracy the power of revolution through the ballot Na baada ya siku tatu kwenye majengo ya bunge mwili wa Kibaki ulisafirishwa nje na wabunge kwa sheria mwanzo wa safari ya mwisho hapa duniani majengo ambayo yalitangamana na wabunge wengine kwa miaka 49 na huku ibada ya mazishi kitarajiwa siku ya Ijumaa katika uwanja wa Nyayo, Waziri wa Usalama Daktari Fred Matiangi anasema kuwa mipango yote iko shwari. So the program here will commence at 8 o'clock. We expect that we all should be seated at 8 o'clock and then we'll wait for the arrival uh, of the body of His Excellency President Mwai Kibaki as will be led by the KDF. And then we'll conduct the mass here. Um, until probably about one o'clock or thereabout before uh, we disperse. Matiangi akiwasihi wa Kenya kuheshimu saa ya kuasili na kuwa tayari kwenye uwanja huo. This is a ceremony that involves a lot of people and we want to make sure that no one is inconvenienced. And for a state funeral of a head of state or a former head of state as the case is here, we are all led by the KDF and we observe the protocols of the Kenya Defence Forces. We will do everything according to the guidance we will have been given by the KDF and we are very very grateful for the professionalism the manner in which our KDF has conducted this so far and has conducted such events in the past. Huko Odhaya katika kaunti ya Nyeri ambapo mwili wake Rais Kibaki utazikwa mipango bado inaendelea. We'll be ready by tomorrow evening as you have seen the tent has already been set we are also going to set an extra tent uh, so that it can supplement the, the one that is already here we are making arrangements for 15000 monas however with the provision for any extra monas that will come kwa sasa mwili wake Rais Kibaki umelazwa katika makafani ya Lee hadi kesho kuto utaondolewa kutoka ikulu ya Rais siku ya Ijumaa na kusafirishwa hadi uwanja wa Nyayo kwa ibada ya wafu kisha utapelekwa Odhaya kwa mazishi Jacqueline Mwigai Running Citizen